place. Place is not just the location where you're buying to sell. So those of us who were at the auction, and in the nicest way, I'm so glad you didn't see me because I had previously been doing hill sprints. Um, I'd done a full 12 hour day working. I then did a bunch of hill sprints up a very, very, very long and very steep hill. And then I turned up at the auction. Like I was not looking amazing, I have to say. Um, but you know, hey, it is how it is. Um, so, um, excuse me, a promotion, promotion it, sorry a place is not just location but the ones at the auction where the place was very what i would term conservative were the ones that went crazy you know the, the very the heartland of conservative property investing was where the auction went crazy and the kind of bits around the edges and location where i was like the dean lane flats i'm like man we bought and sell flats really well on that street you know those are i know that street you know i know how good that street is i was surprised by that so I'm not just talking about location, although if you're buying to sell quite clearly in a rising market, location, location, location. I think I mentioned last month, I did a buy to sell in Pembroke Road in the recession in Clifton, and I saw two or three months ago that it was up for sale again, and I just did not dare look. I would have been so upset. Mm. Um, but where are you going to buy and sell? What place are you going to use to buy and sell? Are you going to choose the internet? Are you going to do it yourself? Are you going to use an estate agent? So what is your thought? Who is going to self-sell using internet alone? So, D, you will. Would, yeah. Uh, yeah? And why would you not? You're going to save thousands of pounds. So why are Time. you... Uh, Time. The reason why you would not. Time. Yeah. Okay. So can you employ somebody to do it? Hmm? So how much, in, in your buy to sell of your 300,000, how much is your estate agent going to cost you? 1%. 1%, so three grand plus fat, so 3,600. How much does it cost to put a listing on, uh, onto right move through one of these organizations? A couple of hundred quid, yeah, for a page. Couple hundred quid, so 3,600 versus a couple hundred quid. Yeah. I, plus the time to, plus to time. Plus time do viewings and follow up. And Absolutely. I'd rather outsource that to the agent who yeah. sold the largest number of properties in that area. Yeah. So for you, time is still valuable. And so the one thing I would suggest, when you're thinking about place of where you're going to sell, don't just interrogate the salesperson that comes out and says, oh, you've done a lovely job. I really want to sell your house. The people you need to speak to are the, the, the real stars of the estate agency, which are the conveyancers. So who are the conveyancers? And can you meet them? And can you talk with them? And can you understand how good they are? Because actually they're the guys, or the, they're usually the ladies, who are going to be vital to your sale. Not the person opening the door, quite frankly. Because the market is going to sell the house for you. Your staging is going to sell the house for you. And then it's, it's the conveyances in the estate agency that's going to be important. So I, that's what I want you to consider when you think about place. Or do it your way, saves 3,600 minus a couple hundred quid, and then look at the time it takes. And then um, I will give you our convincing document for you to follow three times a, a week. Um, just to push forward.